what's up guys it's your girl Shay and I'm back with another video today we're going to be doing something a little bit different I'm going to be showing you how to make some edible nerd ropes I had so much fun making this video if you want more videos like this hit the subscribe button and comment down below for more all right let's get right into this video these are all the things that you're going to need parchment paper two boxes of nerds a squeeze bottle one cup of gummy bears and one tablespoon of your tincture i did this off camera but you're going to want to put your parchment paper into accordion like shape so it looks something like this now pour your nerd ropes onto the parchment paper make sure you cover the bottom of them so that way the melted gummies will only stick to the nerds this is like my second time actually recording this video. The first time I used foil, which you'll see later on in the clip. My first batch I had actually had a really hard time getting the gummies out of the foil. It was impossible to get out. I hated to throw them away, so I just gave them to somebody, see if what they can do with it. Next, you're going to want to heat your gummies in the microwave for about 30 to 40 seconds. Pour your one tablespoon of tincture in and make sure you mix that BZ real good so that way you can be leaning, baby. Yes, leaning. And I mean leaning. You can always substitute your tincture for a CBD oil as well. It does work the same exact way. I poured my gummy mixture into my squeeze bottle because I thought it would be a little bit easier since I have arthritis in my hands, but it actually was way harder than I thought it would be. Um, it was pretty hard, especially since I'm really working with one hand, but you guys shouldn't have any problem. Make sure you find a squeeze bottle that has a nozzle that's actually a little bit larger than mine. Cause baby, my mixture was super thick like me and didn't want to come out the bottle. But try not to pour too much of the mixture. You want to make sure you get you a little slim thick layer and cover the rest with your nerd ropes. I'm going to let you guys watch the clip here as I struggle my ASS off. And it wasn't coming out for me very well. But just cover as much as you can. Get as much mixture out as you can. Make sure um, your liquid is pretty much as warm as possible. And you guys should be okay. Here is the aftermath after I left my nerds in the refrigerator for about two hours. They did not stick at all on this parchment paper. I'm so happy I did this video twice because when I tell you doing it with the foil was a no-go for me. But I think I'm actually going to try the foil one more time. I wonder if I actually put some coconut oil or some type of oily substance so it won't stick. But we will see. If you guys want to see how to make a tincture or any other videos like this let me know they did come out pretty good and they're actually really really bomb so after the process of actually taking it out of the refrigerator you just want to shake the excess nerds off and it should come out pretty fine I'm so happy I did this video for you guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up as well as comment down below if you want to see more. Share this video out with your friends, your family, your grandmama. If she heard it, just make sure you put some CBD in that BZ. And here is the final look, you guys. Oh, and I actually made some little nerd bites too that you can see in the middle. If you are some triple OGs to the channel, some of you may know I did have a half-baked series going on. And I think I'm going to actually bring that back for a little while and show you guys a couple how to get that ass baked videos. But until next time, guys, make sure you stay tuned in and never tune out.